Hey guys, you're with me, Kevin, from gardening.co.za and today I'm super excited because we've just received our latest shipment of the 0.9 meter plant matters grow bags that uh, we're going to set up so we can get them into our greenhouses. I've got two of them here today, the one which is just the standard uh, raised grow bed and then one with a trellis frame which goes on the top. So we're going to open them up and set them up so you guys can have a quick look. So first off, see my box over here, which I did open up a bit earlier just to double check all the parts. I have two grow bags here today, but normally the kit comes with one, but we're going to set up the two different ones. So I have my two grow bags, and on the inside here I have a whole bunch of connectors. So I have my lengthwise sections, and then I have a whole bunch of legs or feet, which are going to stand the grow bags up. And I've got a whole bunch of connectors on the inside here. So what I'm going to do is just zoom out quickly so you can see how we set both of these up. It's super, super simple. So let's just set that up for you. Right, now that we've got these uh, guys out over here, we're going to just open up our grow bags. These ones are the 0.9 by 0.9 meters. So I'll move this guy out the way and we'll set up this one to start, which will just be our basic frame. So I'm going to need one, two, three, four side sections and then I'm just going to need my feet. One, two, three, four feet over here and that's going to go in each corner and then I just need my corner joints, my 90 degree corners. I'm going to need four of those. One, two, three, four. So let's uh, set these up quickly. Right, you can see I have the first one set up 100%. It was relatively easy to do. You just slot it all in and you're ready to go. So I'm going to move this guy out the way and we're going to set up the one with the trellis now as well. Okay, so trellis is exactly the same, only it has your connection pieces have an additional pop-up section for you to put the trellis over the top. So I have my four pieces around the sides one two three four then I have my angle sections my 90 degrees and then the rest over here is my legs so there is the legs and then this is the frame which we'll do after we've assembled this and you can choose as to whether you want to purchase just the standard grow bag or the uh, add-on with the trellis as well completely up to you so let's get this one set up right you can see we've got the frame at the bottom set up so now I'm going to move on to the trellis section so that is using all of the top sections now so I'm just going to divide them out into my squares so this is the top and then I have my stands which are going to go straight up so I'll just slot these in here So as you can see, that was quite easy to put together. So this one, I could now use this as my trellis. So if I wanted to grow vining tomatoes or any other kind of vining plant, I could use this as the support. But also if this was put outside where it's uh, super hot, if it gets scorching afternoon sun, I could hang some shade netting over the side. Um, and even in winter, as a frost protector, we can just wrap some frost protection blanket around there as well, and that will protect everything that's inside. Both these plant matters grow bags are made of the 300 GSM breathable material so that we all know is really good for the root systems of the plants because it helps air prune the roots off. It also allows a lot of air so the plants can breathe very easily and there's excellent drainage as well. Top tip from me for these we found that works really well to fill these is a mixture of good quality compost and potting soil and we've even mixed in uh, hay bales as well just to bulk it up to start with because it can get quite expensive to fill these so you can just buy a hay bale from your local farm store and just stick that in there and mix it in with the, the compost and then just create a thick layer of compost a thick about 10 centimeters compost at the top to plant your herbs and your veggies and then everything else will start to settle itself down. So there you have it, our two raised garden beds, the 0.9 meters from Plant Matters, um, half a meter deep, um, and these are perfect. We're super excited to get these into our greenhouse, so uh, 
Let's uh, do that and we'll show you some pictures at the end of this video.